I'm your host, Danielle Banks, and today I'm here with Ashley Wilson and Chanel Sanchez of Expressive Media Network. Ladies, welcome. Hi. Hi. And why don't you guys tell everybody what uh, what exactly Expressive Media Network is, what you all do? Well, Expressive Media Network is a referral networking business where a client can come and get everything they need for their next creative endeavor all in one place. Okay, that sounds cool. And what, what type of venues do you have uh, involved in there? Our vendors are all, um, they're either creative industries, arts industries, um, events industries, anything that would go into making a wedding or if you were starting your business or any type of creative project. We pretty much have every vendor you would need. What are exactly some of your vendors that you have uh, in place? We currently have a lot of fashion um, vendors. We have stylists. We have um, people that make wedding gowns. We have makeup artists. We have hairstylists, photographers. Um, we have a lot of product lines, beauty product lines, cosmetic lines, um, graphic designers, caterers. We, ha we have a lot and a lot more coming. We have a lot more. Okay, so you're really like the one-stop shop yes. Um, yes. for whatever you need. That but you're not just limited to weddings though, right? No. no. So let's say uh, you have a client that you know has a, a need. What, what is it that the client would be coming to you for? outside of a wedding, for example, what would they need to come to Expressive Media Network for to be their one-stop shop? If a client was having a wedding or they were starting a business or any type of creative endeavor, we have some sort of vendor that can fulfill all their needs. Um, usually when you're starting a business, you kind of need some of the same things that somebody planning a wedding would need. You need mm -hmm. photographers, you need graphics, you need somebody who can do print work. We have all that. So no matter what it is, we have vendors that can fulfill every single need that you have to have to complete the project, whether it's an event or starting a business. Cool, so if somebody wanted to be a part of Expressive Media Network, how would they get involved? Are there any special qualifications they need? Um, how do they sign up? Well, they can contact us at our website, um, www.expressivemedianetwork.com, and um, they can get in contact with Ashley or I. Our email is on the website. And basically what we would do is go over them what it is that they bring to the table, what um, area of business that they're in. We'll discuss what our standard is. Um, we are a business that is solely ran off of integrity excellence. So basically we just go over there with them and meet with them and um, see what we can do to help each other out. Okay, so I guess that's a good leading question to what makes your design inspired, eternally manifested? How is it that you all really pull your inspiration from God and you feel that he uses you to manifest this business in the earth? I, I feel like God actually brought everybody together around each other. Mm -hmm. It wasn't by chance that everybody that we were around um, was pursuing their creative talents mm -hmm. and God placed these talents in all of us mm -hmm. and we have to fulfill them. <laughs> that's, that's part of how we glorify him and being able to do that and appreciate and believe in him to bring the next vendors to us, to, to have clients come to us. We, we believe solely in him to do all of that. So he's working in all of us the whole time. <laughs> awesome. We also think that it was just amazing how um, me and Ashley, when we, when we first met, well, we had like this just immediate connection and we started talking and she's very, very, very creative in everything that she does. And I'm kind of just the one that puts everything together and executes the plan. Mm -hmm. But we figured that um, why not do something about all this talent that we've seen all around us? Mm -hmm. You can't just, we just felt as though we had to bring it together. And mm -hmm. we really believe that God placed that on the inside of us to, to, to network off of each other where it's not a competition, everybody's helping each other. Okay. So if someone was involved in Expressive Media Network, um, as Ashley, I know you are uh, with your own photography business, um, as well as I am for uh, <laughs> my bridal business, what is it uh, that, they, that they do once they're involved? How do they go about promoting Expressive Media? How, how would they present it? Well, for example, um, I am an event planner with Jaywood Events, which is also with Expressive Media Network. And say, for instance, I was meeting with a client um, for a wedding, and I'm talking with the bride, and you know for a wedding you need so many things. Mm -hmm. So we're talking, and she's discussing how, well, then I need a caterer, I need a photographer, I need a makeup artist. 
it's then that I will say, well, I am um, associated with a network and referral company called Express Media Network, and we have a makeup artist, we have a caterer, we have everything you need, and that totally puts the client at ease knowing that they can come to one place and get everything that they need. On top of that, Ashley and I have established relationships mm -hmm. with our vendors. You're not just getting somebody off the street that we don't know anything about. Mm -hmm. So as we're referring, I can refer with confidence because I know these people. Part of our tools that we're using to promote is, like she said, when she's speaking to somebody, that bride, we have promotional booklets that we're going to be giving them mm -hmm. that is literally a magazine style um, to sell each business. They have their own page as a profile. Um, another thing that is really huge that I feel is going to set Express Media apart is the website. It's going to be extremely interactive, very lifestyle oriented. The, everybody's going to want to go on because it's just going to have a lot of cool blogs and a lot of cool you know, tips of the weeks and features. And it's going to have a place where each vendor can literally visually sell their service. It's not just mm -hmm. clicking on a link. There's a lot of directory websites where it's literally just, here's a, here's a lot of links. We want to visually be able to sell somebody where they don't even have to go to another website because they feel comfortable contacting us because we match the style that they wanted. Mm -hmm. And that we'll have at least three or four in each industry to offer them. People have different styles. Mm -hmm. We want to be able to offer that to them. And that what we have is quality. It's not just a huge directory of, mm -hmm. of links. Mm -hmm. And talk a little bit about how, I know you spoke before about um, that your runoff of integrity. Talk a little bit about how the integrity that you run your business off of sets you apart from other businesses. Well, integrity, like you mentioned, is, is a major thing for us, meaning that when we go meet with a client, when we're on a job, they can expect from us the utmost superior in client service. Um, we walk out everything that we do in absolute excellence. Because not only do we do this as unto our clients, but the most important part is we do this unto God. Mm -hmm. um, he is the one that has blessed us in everything that we do. So really, in every single job, we're doing it to glorify God as unto God. And when you're, when you're geared towards that, it makes integrity and excellence very simple that's really awesome so what is it you think that god really wants to get out through you all like how do you think he wants to use expressive media network to touch other people's lives i feel like it instantly brings us around people that he would want us to demonstrate his love to um sometimes you can demonstrate and share the love of god through your character mm -hmm. and how you are um when we're on our jobs, we're not going to be cursing. We'll, we'll be speaking peace into these people's lives. Mm -hmm. We'll always be encouraging to them and calm to them. A place of peace for mm -hmm. them. Mm -hmm. And especially usually when you're planning something, that's going to be something right. that you're looking for. Right, right. <laughs> but it's it's amazing because it's cool. I personally think, and I've seen it happen, mm -hmm. it brings you around people you might not have normally been around mm. that might have needed just, just a little bit of peace in their life or to see something that shows them that, you know, you demonstrate the love of God. You walk out the love of God. You, mm -hmm. you The talents that you have, are ones that God put in you, you know, and I think it's very important that, you know, creative things that God placed in us are important and they're manifested and they're there for a reason. Now, do you have to be a Christian to be a part of Expressive Media? No, no. It, it happens that most of the people already that are involved are, mm -hmm. but um, no, we're not going to make that a requirement. We don't want to box the, the vision in. <laughs> we are the church without walls, so basically, you know, we go out and like Ashley was saying, get to meet with people that we would never, might not come across. You know, you, we don't keep everything inside the church when we are supposed to go out and meet with people who normally would not come to a church. It's amazing how when you just go out, you'll be able to expose yourself to um, people who you normally wouldn't see or talk to mm -hmm. or um, meet, but I believe that everything is ordered our steps are ordered by God so do you have a testimony that you'd like to share um that you've experienced through expressive media so far of somebody's life you may have touched or uh, a memorable story or something actually when I was going to go get some of the the print-ups done mm -hmm. the lady who was in um she was doing the print-up she was actually reading it okay. and she was curious about what it was and I explained mm -hmm. to her and she really felt inspired by the fact that it was um you know, not just a man-oriented thing. It was mm -hmm. women that were doing it, and mm -hmm. that it was a um, something that was led by believers. Mm -hmm. She um, really liked that idea. She said that she had always kind of felt like 
you know, the Christian life, it was very impoverished and you, you, could, mm. you couldn't, you know, prosper and you, mm-hmm. you had to be so meek. And she was just like, I didn't know that, you know, it was okay to do these kind of things and, and live a Christian life. Mm-hmm. So that was kind of cool because I didn't know that she was kind of pursuing some of her own things. That's really awesome that you touched on two things um, about being a Christian. I think that's a big stigma that goes with it. To be a Christian, you have to be poor. And, you know, <laughs> the scripture talks about Jesus, you know, became poor so that we might become rich, not so that we could stay poor. And so I think this is really awesome that he's working through you ladies and through everybody connected in your network to really get out there and reach everyone. And then I want to hear a little bit about how it is to be the president and vice president, two women, two young, <laughs> strong women being owned owners of a business how how has that been it's been amazing I, I couldn't have a better partner we we mix very well like she said earlier I'm very creative and have a lot of ideas and um, it's good to have somebody that is an executor of those things and kind of you know orders it mm-hmm. <laughs> and so we've kind of just worked together and gotten a lot of the materials together and found creative and resourceful ways to get everything done we've been able to do a lot of things on our own mm-hmm. we've created a lot of the booklets on our own we've done a lot of the writing we've um, I've made the website a uh, skeleton website just so that when we do have a designer once we have everybody's business profiles in and ready mm-hmm. you know to have a, a really interactive website so we've had the ability to do a lot of things ourselves and we've had to pray for the ability to do these things and resources to come and, and ways to do things because a lot of times there was obstacles that could have stopped it. Mm-hmm. And we refused to accept that because we knew that wasn't, that wasn't what God wanted because he placed it in us to do this. Well, it's been an absolute amazing journey. And this is just the beginning with um, working with Ashley. Um, we are truly, truly great friends, and you would think that sometimes, you know, it's not great to go into business with your friends <laughs> and all that type of stuff, but we are both, um, we were both really walking out and believing what we believe God has called both of us to do. Um, among the many other things that he's calling us to do, this is not the only thing, so mm-hmm. it's, it's really grace that's on our lives to be able to carry out um, expressive media plus the many other um, projects that we both have going on, and they're all just very successful, and I I give that all glory to God because he's just poured his grace out on everything that we have done. He's blessed everything that we have touched. So I'm just really thankful for that, and um, like Ashley was saying, she's she's very creative, and and, and I execute those things, and we are very resourceful (laughs) in what we do, so... It's just been amazing, and I just look forward to the journey. It is nice to have somebody, though, on those days where the business aspect of it comes mm-hmm. in, and you feel a little overwhelmed, mm-hmm. and the, the, the vision is eating you almost, mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Um, to be able to bounce and vent off somebody who um, is a believer and, and can give you that insight that, you know, just, just to relax, and we go back and forth some days, and, mm-hmm. <laughs> you know, it's just a lot of support and, and encouragement on both sides. Yeah. So is there any uh, particular vendor that you all are in need of right now? We have opening spots for (laughs) (laughs) We definitely want to pursue um, somebody who does professional lighting. Um, A lot of brides and grooms like certain kind of lighting at their Mm -hmm. weddings. really makes change in ambiance. Mm -hmm. Um, A florist. Florist. We definitely love a florist. Yes, got to have those for weddings. (laughs) (laughs) Huge, but... um, Mostly everything else we, we really are believing in God for, but those are the, the two main things that we really feel like are, are missing puzzle pieces that have yet to come, but okay. will come. We know that. Amen. Yes. Well, thank you ladies so much for being on the show. And again, you all can check them out on their website, and that's www.expressivemedianetwork.com, and there will be links to that on our main page. And thank you ladies again. It was a pleasure talking with you both. Thank you for having me.